For Ralph and Karen Jones, making the most out of their money meant making a big move. I didn't think that we could maintain the lifestyle that we wanted if we stayed in New York after retiring. Um, and coming down here was just amazing to see the difference in what your money would buy, how much you could get for your money. Concerned that even a million dollar nest egg wasn't going to go far in suburban New York, the Joneses relocated to Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. They bought a new house and now pay a fraction of the property taxes they once did, freeing up funds to vacation frequently and make big ticket purchases when they want. The Joneses aren't your typical retirees. U.S. Census Bureau data shows less than 8% of the U.S. population has a million dollars. Yet many financial advisors warn even a seven-figure sum may not be enough to retire. If they want to retire with an income and be financially independent, not dependent on anybody else, and be able to have an income of $40,000, then it's likely that they're going to need a million dollars to retire. Living comfortably on $40,000 a year in retirement, requiring a million dollar nest egg, will depend on your expenses, investment returns, health care costs. This figure does not factor in other benefits such as pensions and Social Security, which can greatly boost your retirement income. Many retirees make it work with less. Census Bureau data shows the median household income for those 65 and older is $34,000. But that's down from $66,000 for those 55 to 64 years old. In order to preserve that pre-retirement standard of living, financial experts say you may need more than a million dollars. A million dollars, it could be enough, it might not be enough. It really depends upon sort of what you anticipate your retirement to be and what you were earning um, before retirement. That's the million dollar question. For Nightly Business Report, I'm Sharon Epperson.